Hey everybody, uh, this is Adam Weiser from the Fluke Corporation. Today I'm here at Test Equipment Depot and we are here to talk about the brand new Fluke 1770 series power quality analyzers. This is a brand new product that just launched. It is our newest and uh, most advanced power quality analyzer to date. All new uh, user interface, all new box, really cool, really easy to use. So we're just going to run through a couple of the features for you. Um, on the top, you're going to see that I've got my inputs for voltage and for current. Right now, I'm, I'm plugged into an outlet, but I do have the ability to uh, power this off the measurement circuit. So if I'm in a remote location, um, I'm able to power this right off the circuit that I'm taking measurements from. Uh, if you look at the front of the unit, you can see that it's an all new interface. This is a touch screen. Uh, we've got LEDs here indicating that I've got good connections on my uh, both my voltage and my current. Everything else is pretty much on the touch screen. If I go in here to PQ meter mode, I'm seeing now live readings. I've got this hooked up to a demo board. We're just getting live readings on a on a three phase circuit. So I'm looking at um, I'm looking at volts, amps and hertz. There's a couple nice things about this feature. Um, I can look at this live or I can record data anytime I want. Um, in order to record, I need to make sure that I'm connected to the circuit properly. So you'll see on phase C, I actually intentionally turn one of my uh, current clamps backwards. So the really nice thing about this is that rather than have to go back into the measurement panel and, and physically change the, the direction of the current clamp, I can actually just go down in here and I can hit autocorrect. And this takes me to a screen where I'm actually able to adjust the phaser diagram. I can go in here and adjust this manually, but all I have to do is hit done. And what this, what this has now done is this has now adjusted that current clamp automatically without me having to go in and touch any wires. So much safer. I can also, um, I can also look at this as in scope meter mode. So I'm right now looking at uh, voltage across uh, all three phases. I have the ability to look at, uh, I can look at just current, or I can look at voltage and current at the same time on a nice split screen. This unit is preset with a number of different uh, circuit types, so I can measure anything from a single phase all the way up to a three phase Y, three phase delta. Gives you a nice little wiring diagram so you don't mess anything up when you're, when you're hooking up. So now that, I'm, now that I've set up my circuit, I can go in here and hit start. Now I'm recording. So if there's something that I wanna capture, um, I'm able to look at this live on the screen, but on the left-hand side here, I can go in and I can look at all different kinds of, of different parameters. I can look at voltage and current. I can look at my power measurements. So, you know, what's my, what's my KVA? What's my KVAR? What's my power factor? How clean is my power? I can look at dips and swells. I can look at harmonics. I can look at total harmonic distortion all the way up to the 50th harmonic. Uh, you can look at transients. This will capture events as well. So if there's anything like a dip or a swell or an inrush, this is going to capture it for you and it's going to date and timestamp it. It's going to put it into this table here so you can look at this. This is all happening in the background. There's absolutely no pre-setup that needs to happen. Um, it's really just hook it up and go. It's very easy to use. I'm going to go back to the home screen. I'm going to stop this recording. So the other mode is PQ logger mode. So this would be more of a long-term recording session. So I, maybe I want to leave it for a week. Maybe I want to leave it for 30 days. And I want to see what's going on in the facility <clears throat> for a longer period of time. So same thing applies. I would go in here to my measurement settings, um, set my nominal, um, set my, my current and my, my voltage ratios. I can, I can adjust my event triggers. So this is set up to do EN 50160 electrical standards. These are adjustable, so you can go in and adjust them based on your own needs. Um, I can also go into the specifics of the session itself. I can put in a description. I can do my start and stop time. This is automatically going to give me feedback as to how much memory I'm using too. So I'm not going to, I'm not going to overtax the memory. But this thing has 32 gigs of built-in memory, so it's, it's got a lot of storage capacity. And then once I have all the parameters set, I'm gonna hit the start button. So now I'm recording. This is something now that I could just 
sit, sit inside a panel and leave it and record for as long as I want. Um, one other thing you can do while I am recording in logger mode, I can look at things like PQ Health. This is a single screen where I can take a look at all of these different power quality measurements. I can look at, I can look at frequency, I can look at voltage, I can look at harmonics, um, I can look at it as a phaser diagram. This is a really nice spot. It's a one shot, one screen. I can see everything that's going on and it will tell me if it's pass fail. Thanks for watching. Um, my name's Adam Weiser, I'm with the Fluke Corporation. And uh, if you have any questions, you can reach out to the folks at Test Equipment Depot for more information. Thank you.